Isn't it great to know how to achieve flawless skin without lots of makeup and pricey products? Hey there guys, welcome back to my channel and I hope you guys are doing amazing. So today I'm going to tell you the do's of achieving flawless skin. So there are certain things that we could actually do in our day to day routine or in our life simply so that we can get flawless skin and we need not actually spend lots of money to do that as well so this is going to be interesting guys and let's move into this but before that if you are new to my channel and haven't subscribed my beautiful family yet then you really need to do by clicking on the subscribe button down below and do not forget to turn on the small notification bell so that you stay updated every time I post a video and now finally let's get started with this now there are actually certain kind of foods that you should be having in order to have flawless skin. Now which are supposed to be rich in vitamin C, sulfur and vitamin E. And let me take each one of them one by one. Humans do not synthesize vitamin C in their cells so we constantly need to replenish our stores. Now how can you do that? Also guys I have done an elaborate video on vitamin C and its benefits and the benefit of using it in your diet and in your skincare regime as a product as well. So you can watch that video later after watching this one but if I sum up in short vitamin C actually helps boost collagen and it removes any signs of aging in your skin so therefore it means you're going to have supple skin, youthful looking skin and a brightened skin. One of the Food sources that you should be moving towards in order to have a lot of vitamin C. So the first one is citrus fruits such as oranges, then green leafy vegetables, then berries such as strawberries, raspberries, blackberries and blueberries all are very yummy and fruits like papaya and guava all of them are rich in vitamin C. So what are you waiting for? Just go and dump on them. Now let's move to the sulfur rich food. So if I sum up about sulfur and its benefits first for your skin so it actually exfoliates dead skin cells that is it removes any dead skin cells internally that is super awesome that does reduce the work of scrub you know less external hard work the food sources are eggs meat and fish uh, again the daily product as well but this is not supposed to be powdered milk you have to get the real milk and then leaf vegetables again we have then we have onion garlics Ginger, all of them are rich sources of sulfur. Now the next one is vitamin E. Now vitamin E and vitamin C when coupled together they are super awesome for your skin. Broccoli and flax seeds and pumpkin seeds, the sunflower seeds, all of them are a great source of vitamin E. So here we are with the food and just make sure that you're having all of them in your diet as soon as possible in order to have a flawless looking skin. Do number two, your morning skincare routine. Now most of us do not have a great morning skincare routine and what we actually do is we wash your face and step out. That's it. Now this is really bad for your skin if it's good for you. <laughs> now what you need to do is you need to wash your face and you need to tone your face then you need to moisturize and then you have to apply an SPF. So these four steps are very very compulsory for a great morning skincare routine and at least twice a week you are supposed to scrub your face and apply a face mask or a peel of mask. You can choose between any of them. Also guys, take care that you are not peeling your skin off by using a harsh scrub. You have to use a very gentle scrub which cleanses your pores and just keeps them happy. Just them. And avoid hot water and use cold water because cold water actually closes your pores. Now most of us actually do not at all have a night skin routine. Just not the sun which we're supposed to be afraid of but also the dirt particles, the micro dust particles which actually get into your pores and stay over there all throughout the night which is the best time your skin has to replenish itself and to repair itself. So just aid your skin in that process by just washing your face. Now nowadays what I have done is I've also aided that process or I would say I've added added one extra step to that process and that is using an eye cream because um, as I said night is the best time for our skin to repair itself so I want to supply it with all the good things so currently I am using the Mama Earth Bye Bye Talk Circles and you know I have a very long association 
now <laughs> with Mama Hall. So I just picked up on this uh, Bye Bye Dark Circles cream because um, every time in the morning when you wake up at times we have, you know, baggy eyes and eyes with dark circles and that is really weird. So what I do is I apply just dots of it around my eye and then I massage it in circular motion and I am done. Plus this cream has cucumber and peptides in it. The cucumber is super great for your eyes because it cools it down and your eyes will feel relaxed. And peptides are supposed to regenerate collagen and therefore make your skin youthful and brighter and supple. That means your delicate skin right over here will become very bright and will be wrinkle free and that is awesome just make sure that your nighttime skincare routine is including washing your face applying a moisturizer and using a eye cream no sleep plus stress equals to you are dead man most of us stay awake like to two o'clock at night and that's crazy only if you're working and you are really hustling but for all of us who are just using a phone and actually hurting our eyes this is really bad so what you need to do is you need to sleep on time you just need to relax stay calm and doze off so just make sure you're getting that because then your skin will be super happy this is the least you can do for it guys let me read it aloud from a blog by Real Simple. So I was just checking out for what are the habits of people with flawless skin. And there I got to know about a very amazing fact. And I was like, wow, this is great. And it said that a research presented at last year's annual American Medical Society for Sports medicine meeting showed that previously sedentary subjects who started a regular exercise routine actually experienced a reversal in their signs of aging and that is great that means if you exercise for at least 30 minutes for five days a week you are going to experience a skin which is youthful and flawless and that is very logical friends because you are exercising your blood flow would be great because circulation of so your circulation of blood would be great and you will feel youthful that is what I mean. No, I just mean to say that you'll feel active and you'll have a great energy around yourself and that would actually reflect onto your skin. So it's good. And that's it guys. So these are very, very simple steps that you can inculcate in your daily routine. So if you follow any of these steps, please let me know down in the description box below. Or if you have anything else to add in order to have a flawless skin, for example, a homemade mask to try or a homemade scrub that you use, then feel free to comment it down in the description box below because my fam would love to know about it. And yes, I'm going to see you guys in my next next one till then stay blessed and stay happy bye